with Karen, who um, has got a couple of minutes to spare for us, who's the director of the family scrap store, and she's been good enough to give, uh, agree to give us an interview for, Shape, for the Shape Your Place website. Hello Karen, Hello. I'm Reg, thank you very much for sparing a little bit of time. Um, Fenland Scrap Store, to some people, it might be a sort of slightly strange description, but what, what, what is it that you actually do? What we actually do is we take um, industrial off-cut products and we redistribute them to youth groups, brownies, schools, individuals. We also take donations from the general public and we can pass things back um, to be recycled and reused and repurposed. Right, and... and <laughs> Do people bring items to you that they're donating? Yeah, people can bring items into us. We're happy to take things, or we can go around and collect larger quantities of items. Okay, and and you, any funds that you raise go towards other providing other activities. Is Everything that, that we raise for Fenland Scrap Store is actually ploughed back into Fenland Scrap Store. Everybody that works here are volunteers. Um, we're a social enterprise. Uh, we don't currently receive any funding, um, so we completely fund ourselves. Right. Okay. Well, thank you. Uh, we're now out um, outside the Fenland Scrap Store, um, and Tracy here has agreed to give Shape Your Place a little interview, and she's one of the customers, and has been buying large sheets of board. So, I'm Reg Tracy, anyway, Hi. good of you to uh, talk to us. Can you tell us what you're going to do with this board that you've bought? This board in particular is to make a stand to go outside the event that I'm putting together. The Felon Scrap Store's been brilliant for getting materials and things that I can use, so I'm not buying everything new to distress it. Right, <laughs> so right. So, it good. makes more sense to use stuff so, that's old so and already had a use. Right. So it's a good place for you to come? It's a brilliant place yeah. to come. I've had a few bits and pieces off right. of them. I okay. came up on their open day, bought a massive bag of material for £2.50, which I've made my outfit out of. Oh, right. Lovely. So, so compared uh, so to it buying all gets... a, a, another shop of buying something to water or going into a fancy dress shop yeah. and paying all that money out. Right, yeah. And this is actually going to go towards This is the... going to hold 90 pumpkins. Oh, right. <laughs> well, up to 90 pumpkins. Yes. One of the competitions on the night is for the pumpkins which I'm judging. And they've got to be themed and do things with them. And all that information. And I'm hoping it's going to become a yearly event that's going to be more and more competitive as the oh, years right. go on. Oh, good. So I'm looking well, forward to that. Good luck with it. Thank and, you. Uh, thanks very much for your time.